I need to go buy some more antidotes at this rate. Goodness me. Goodness me. I talk like an old lady sometimes when I'm recording. I don't know why. I think it's because I'm trying not to say a bunch of swear words, which is 90% of my vocabulary most of the time, but apparently YouTube doesn't like it because they're soft. They want me to be kid friendly, so that's what we gotta do sometimes. Yeah, so I need <laughs> trying to think of what to say that's not just the F word constantly. And um ends up talking like a grandma. Welcome back everybody to the Pokemon Randomized Nuzlocke. We are playing Ruby, so it is a Ruby Randomized Nuzlocke. Look at these fellas, and they're quite handsome. They look like little devils. <laughs> this is episode 10. We have made it to the double digits. We have made it quite far. Not really, we're actually only in Slateport, but I feel good about this. Feeling good about this series. Have we got anything to sell? Uh... Well, that was quite a moan. Um, yeah, we got a... We got a pearl, we could sell it for 700 bucks! 700 dollar dues! Um, no, not right. not much though. Um, how many Pokeballs have we got? I didn't see. Actually, let's ha let's- let's be smart about this, let's check the bag. We have... I know we have one potion, I don't know what I'm checking. One potion, two antidote, yeah, we need a bit more. 12 Pokeballs, so that's not too bad. One Great Ball, one Premier Ball. Alright, so we'll start off. Potions. I want. I want seven potions. Got a couple of antidotes still. We got one paralyze heal. I always like to have an escape rope, just the one, just in case we get a real good encounter. Let's do that. And oh, in case we get a real, real good encounter. Let's do that. And let's do that. <laughs> I probably didn't need to spend all my money just yet, but I would rather be safe than sorry, if I'm being quite honest. <laughs> that was a burp and a half. I almost threw up. Apologies. Uh, the water is clean. The fruits of bountiful harvest gather. No, where they are clean, they gather. And where people gather, a market soon starts. Speaking of markets, I went to the market today. I told you that in the last episode, though. I'm not going to go on about it. <laughs> it was wonderful. Stern's Shipyard wanted a sailor who is salty. A salty sailor. Uh, <laughs> Pokemon has a hasty nature. It is high speed compared to other Pokemon. Maybe the nature has something to do with the stat gains of the Pokemon. Yeah. I don't know why in the older games they didn't just write down on there somewhere what it meant. <laughs> like, why did they have to keep it mysterious? I just want to know. What does the nature do? I don't want to have to use an outside program or Google it to figure it out. At least in new games, it's just like up and down, which is what I want to know. I spent all my money, so hopefully there's nothing good at these markets. Yeah, no, I'm not affording that stuff. And you? Um, no, you're boring. You're boring. Also boring. Also boring. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> if I'm being quite honest, I don't really remember what to do when you get to Slateport. I get a bit muddled up. Uh, he's the chairman of the Pokemon fan club, if you didn't know. Uh, he's naturally the most important. That is quite rude of him to say. He should not be so pompous. Uh, yeah, shut up. Blah, 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 blah. Are you going to give me something? Nah, whatever. <laughs> I feel like there's something I'm meant to do there, but I don't remember what. Who are you? Name Raider's House. We have perfect nicknames. We're not rating any of them. really want to do a contest. I don't think I need to do a contest. You need a contest pass before you can do a contest, so that's quite fine. There's a building here. What are you? Slateport Harbour. Oh yeah, we got to see Captain Stern. <laughs> that's right. He's not here though. He's probably at Stern's shipyard or whatever the hell it was called, the one we first checked out. But also, what's here? Oceanic Museum. Okay. No, I think it's here. G'day. Oh, that there, they are Devon Goods. But hmm, this won't do. Captain Stone went off somewhere. He said he had some work to do. Could you get 
could I get you to go find Captain Stern and deliver that to him? Oh, I guess. Uh, yeah, oh, I think so. Uh, the season, the weather, the moon, it sits in the sky. All these conditions make the sea change its expression. That's right, the sea is like a living thing. God, I need to do cardio. I couldn't even finish that sentence with blah, 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 without running out of breath. Oh, mush mouth today, my goodness. My <gasps> new route, new route means new Pokemon. G'day. Now you're boring. Route 110, all right. New encounter. What are we hoping for? Leave it in the comments. What are we hoping for? <laughs> yeah, that's right. I'm a YouTuber. I say leave it in the comments. I am hoping for a Mewtwo. That's a Blastoise. I'm quite okay with that, if I'm being honest. I swear I just went to the Poke Center. Why am I not fully healed? I think it... I don't know. Anyway, good, good start. Good start. Use wrap. Slowly whittle you down. Oh, that's a crit. Good, you're not going to do too much damage. That's what we like to see. The wrap will slowly whittle you down. The paralyze is coming in handy. Oh my goodness, I can't... I can't stop burping. <laughs> so sorry. Don't... Oh my god, if you die from the wrap now, I'm going to be really angry. Alright, we've got a few turns to catch it. Mm. Alright, we'll start with the Pokeball, and then next turn we're going with the Great Balls. Because Blastoise would be a huge asset to the team, not gonna lie. You suck. Mm. Alright, that was pretty good. We got a couple of shakes off. Now with a Great Ball. Mm. Come on, don't mess me around, boy. That par paralysis is honestly doing work. I don't know if Rap lasts forever. I don't think it does. So hopefully it knocks him down to red and then we can. Oh, yes. I was going to clap, but that's going to be real loud on the microphone. So let's just golf clap, golf clap. This is Blastoise. He's a shellfish Pokemon. He does not look like a fish. He's a turtle. He's a turtle, not a shellfish. Uh, he's five foot three, one hundred and eighty-eight point five pounds. Blastoise has water spouts that protrude from his shell. The water spouts are very accurate. They can shoot bullets of water with enough accuracy to strike empty cans from a distance of over one hundred and sixty feet. I like that Blastoise is just hanging out shooting cans off a fence, like a bit of a redneck. <laughs> Sorry, rednecks. Or people who shoot cans off fences and aren't rednecks. My bad. Anyway, there is no doubt in my mind this has to be the one, the only, the beautiful man, Ryan. You've probably seen some of his comments on my videos. It's very friendly. No, I love Ryan. He is my guy. And honestly, he looks like a Blastoise. He is a tank. We used to work out together back in the day when we lived in the same town, which saddens me that we don't. <laughs> um, but that was good times. It was a go. Oh, and yeah, Tank, strongest man in existence. So he can be nothing but a Blastoise. <laughs> so there you go, my friend. I'm really happy about that. Let's have a quick sus of the summary. Water type with stench. Also sounds like Ryan. Nah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, helps repel wild Pokemon. I love that. Uh, jolly nature. Uh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh my goodness. Um, no item, no ribbon. Uh, tackle, tail whip, bubble, and withdraw. Not bad at all. Get you to the front of the party. Get you training up. Get a bit of experience in you. Uh, and his nature. What did I say his nature was? Jolly, jolly good, jolly good. He has up in speed, minus special attack. That's a not good nature, but it is what it is. So we'll take it. What could we have got though? What else is in here? We could have had a freaking Latias. Now I'm not gonna say I'm mad, I'm a little mad that I didn't get the Latias. <laughs> I could have, yeah. 
Could add a legendary, but I got the legendary Ryan, so I'm not mad. That's that's not good. No, we're not we're not doing this. We're not doing this. Thought I might get some easy experience off of Latias, but no. No. Okay. That's the way you wanna be? Oh, that was a dumb idea. I'm really dumb. Why was that not super effective? Isn't... If you're a psychic type, I'm not gonna waste time on that. Let's just go to river. My god. Make up my mind, me. Are you... Are you... I don't know. I feel like Latias is just pure psychic, but maybe it's psychic dragon. I don't know. Either way. Must be Psychic Dragon. Should give a little bit of experience. Either way, which is what we like to see. What we like to see. Wild Latias has fainted. Brian got 130. Matt got 130. River got 130. And that... I feel like we need to heal real quick. Just to be safe. Just to be safe. Because it doesn't take much time when you have super speed. Um, alright. Route 110, you're done. No encounters here. Oh, okay, we can't go up here. We did get an encounter, which is nice. But apparently that's as far as we go today. Where, where the heck do I go? Um, no, that's a sub area where you travel later. Where's Captain Stern? Hmm... Who are you? No. No. Oh, okay. Mm. Apparently they've left. Ooh, TM46, okay. Why is he so upset that I just walked into him? I don't understand. Um, water spout. Inflicts more damage if the user's HP is high. Interesting. And when you're at full health, it does more damage. Somehow Ryan can't learn it, but Dom and Hudson can. That's unusual. And Kess. Very unusual. Mm. We got Cut, Leech Life, Supersonic, Astonish, and Water Spout. Oh my lord! That's a powerful move! Okay. Now do we give that to Dom? Um, or do we give it to Hudson? I say we get rid of Leech Life. Leech Life sucks. <laughs> now we know we have a very strong water move with Dom. Alright. No. None of you are interesting. Let's go upstairs. Are you Captain Stern? Sir, are you Captain Stern? That would be me. <laughs> it must be part of the order. No, it must be the part that I ordered from Mr. Stone of Devon. Thank you, that's great. We can prepare for our expedition now. <laughs> Means we're gonna fight. Why do you want the parts? You don't even know what they are, you little idiots. <laughs> you little morons. Artist Zoe would like to battle with an execute. All right. Now we will do some switch training. I don't have anyone with psychic moves, but you're also grass. Let's go with Kess, I think. Let's go with Kess. Question for everyone watching. Somebody might know. Probably not. Oh, I missed. Don't put me to sleep. That's, no, that's annoying. Oh, and leech seed. Come on. Anyway, quick question. Anybody know how I can get my hands on a foreign ditto in my game of Shining Pearl? I want to use the, what is it, the Matsuda method of making eggs and getting shinies and all that fun stuff. But you need a ditto from another region of the game. And there was like, I read an article that said if you go to this particular trading room, 
with a certain code. There'll be people there who will trade your ditto for their ditto. And I went in there for about 10, 15 minutes and no one was there. So I was just like, well, 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 I don't know what to do now. So yeah, if anybody knows, that'd be great. If not, oh well. <laughs> it was worth a shot. Somebody might know. Oh, I need to pay attention to the game. Ooh, got him. Got him. 157 experience each. Not too bad. Kess got to level 17 and wants to learn low kick. Ooh. So a fighting type move. Inflicts more damage on heavier foes. Inflicts more damage when the user's HP is down. I didn't know that about Flail. That's interesting. Let's get rid of Mimic because I'm never going to use it. I don't know why that hand motion. I'm never going to use it. <laughs> I actually went to get a drink and then came back and then apparently that's what I do with my hand. I don't need a drink just yet. I can wait. $300. Thanks, mate. <sighs> Sniveling Wimp, let me take care of this. A Crobat. Oh, Ryan's almost up a level. Um, I don't feel like any of that's going to be good against a Crobat. Hmm, let's go to River. River can do it. I believe in you. I don't like confusion. Not a fan of that. Not a fan whatsoever. Not a fan of Screech either. Because now my defense is lowered, and if I hit myself with confusion, it's going to do more damage. But luckily, I did not. At least for this turn. I was okay. Didn't do a lot of damage. Did a bit of damage. Oh, don't keep Screeching. That's a, that's a, oh, snapped out of confusion. I like that. I was going to say, that's a rough combo. Confusion and Screech, but luckily it did not pay off. Come on. Get out of here, Crobat. I do like Crobat. He is pretty cool. Beautiful purple in this game, too. Beautiful color. Ryan grew level 13. Uh, wants to learn Water Gun. Surely... 40, 20. Yeah. Bubble, get out of here. Nobody uses Bubble. Bubble is useless. Da -da -da. And... Ooh, River almost leveled up. Ah, uh, Wobbuffet. That's terrifying. Let me have a quick think. Alright. Alright, 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 alright. So Wobbuffet has this wonderful moveset where... Basically, if they guess, you're going to use a physical and they guess right. They're going to reverse that damage on you and do a crap ton of damage. And same goes for if you use special. There's like a 50-50 chance they're going to pick the right move and they're going to just absolutely annihilate you. And the other thing is they have... Mm, is Wobba... What typing is Wobba fit? Hmm, I'm actually a little frightened. I reckon we stick with River? I don't know. Let's do a Thunder Wave. I'm going to play it real safe because I'm not losing anyone to a darn Wobbuffet. Do a wrap. That was a crit. That did nothing. Destiny Bond. Okay. See, that's the other worrying thing. You got speed boost. Interesting. So if I kill it on a turn, it uses a Destiny Bond. It also kills my Pokemon. So I need to be really, really, really careful. So maybe I stall out its Destiny Bonds. Hmm. Yeah, this is like the worst Pokemon to encounter in a run. Is you? It basically comes down to luck. You do one wrong move. And they do one right move, and you're just done. I need it to use up its... I think it's got five Destiny Bonds. I'm a bit nervous. A bit nervous. Mm. Yeah, basically, if it runs out of Destiny Bonds... And then I can one hit it, we're safe. So that's why I'm just wearing it down very slowly with Thunder Wave. 
And by wearing it down, I mean wasting turns until it runs out of Destiny Bonds. Thunderwave actually does nothing, but it's the only move I can use that's not going to hurt it. I'm probably being overly cautious. But the amount of Pokemon I've lost in this run so far, I'm just not risking it. I think it's done four Destiny Bonds so far. We'll go a few more turns, and if it doesn't use it, I think we're okay. Oh, I just realized I can... I should be Dragon Dancing. Get that attack nice and high. That way I can definitely one-shot it, and it can't hit me with a counter. There we go. That should be the last Destiny Bond. But there is no harm in waiting it out just a little bit longer. It is better to be safe than to be sorry. As everybody always says. <laughs> Might not be fun to watch, but this is just the way it needs to be, I feel. I think there's no shot I don't one-shot it. But if it uses the Destiny Bond before me, indeed, another Destiny Bond. If I'd attacked that turn, I would have lost River. So now, I don't know how many Destiny Bonds it has. Which is concerning, to say the least. Couple more turns, and if I don't see a Destiny Bond, I'm gonna feel pretty safe. If this isn't a Destiny Bond... Cross your fingers. Cross your toes. Pray for me that we don't lose River, or I am going to scream. No Destiny Bond. I outsped. That did not do enough damage. How did... Ah, oh, Twister must be special in this game it's dragon typing so dragon dance does literally nothing for twister rap would do a, done, a ton of damage but whatever counter missed counter failed because it expected a physical move luckily otherwise that counter would if it had done miracle it would have killed me basically if it had done miracle that turn i would have lost so that was terrifying sorry to stall that out for like five minutes but boba fett scares me <laughs> I came to see what was taking so long to snatch some parts, and you simps are held up by a mere child? A simps? Oh my. I am Team Magma's Maxi. Why on earth do you feel compelled to mess with Team Magma's plans? Pokemon, people, all life exists on land. That's not true. You're an idiot. Uh, that's why Team Magma is trying to expand the world's land mass. Don't you agree? What are we doing? No, what, uh, what we are doing is a magnificent undertaking. I can read. I have an education. <laughs> Uh, well, no matter, you're young, your inability to understand our noble cause can't be helped. But if you were to impede us ever again, I will kill you. I will destroy you. Uh, keep that firmly in mind. It's not what he said. Captain Stern, you're okay, Dylan. Anyway, it was a tense situation. Thanks for saving us. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here's your goods, mate. Here's your goods. Uh, whoops, there's no time to lose. We set out on the ocean floor. Expedition real soon. Thanks and toodle oo. Toodle oo. Anyway, he didn't give me anything for that. But it is what it is, I guess. Part of the game. Let's roll. Boo -boo -boo -boo. All right. We should be able to continue on now. Banana, na, na, na. I like bananas. <laughs> I would go anywhere to show off my delightful Pokemon. <laughs> what she sounds like. Oh, look at the little Whalemers. They're so freaking cute. Surely Whalemers aren't that small. Uh, Leader Scarlet would like to battle. Why are there so many gym leaders around? Loister. Mm, that's. No, no, no. We're not having that. Ooh. Ooh. with Matt. I don't know. I'm not sure who I should use, honestly. 
withdrawal. I feel like I need like an electric Pokemon to really round out the team. It was not the right move to use. I meant to use Arm Thrust. <laughs> Whatever. At least I hit five times. I'm pretty lucky with these multi-move hits. Multi-hit moves. I knew what I meant. Let's try that one. Didn't do much better, honestly. A little bit better, though. Oh, one more. Come on. Missed. Hmm, got yourself a citrus berry, do you? No, an orange berry. Citrus is something else. What a cry. That was great. Uh, right grew to level 14. That is beautiful. Matt grew to level 19. Also wonderful. Matt wants to... No, yeah, Matt wants to learn Fake Out. Everybody knows Fake Out. First turn, first strike move that causes flinching. Uh, like, it could come in handy, but it's not good enough to get rid of any of the moves I have. So, we're not going to learn it. Chansey! Mm, you're one level lower. Can you do it? Nope. That's going to take forever. I'm going to swap to someone else. You know what? I'm going to swap to Matt just because he's got super effective arm thrust. Oh, there's a... Oh my god! That did some damage! There's a rival fight coming up, I just remembered. That's a little bit nerve-wracking. Rival fight in this particular area, I feel like, is quite a tricky one. Um, Ryan grew level 15. Absolutely wonderful. Leader Scarlet has been defeated. Oh dear, this will not do. Here's some cash. Cheers, mate. Cheers, mate. Uh, don't have a bike. Can't take bike path. That's wonderful, old lady. I don't care. Uh, did you feel the tug of your soul? No, of our soul boot suit. I'm just not even going to try. That was a disaster of a sentence. <laughs> Ranger Max has one Pokemon and it's a Gloom. Not too bad. Uh, ba -ba -da -ba -da. Squeeby dee boop. Um, um, let's go with Hudson. He's getting too low level. I need to stop singing it, everything to the tune of this. <laughs> Liquid Ooze. Oh, and it damages him. Nice, nice, nice. That's not too bad. That did some damage. He's going to hurt himself every time, the fool. Does he not understand what he's doing? I am a poisonous. Ooh, speaking of poisonous, apparently he does know what he's doing. Well, that wasn't too bad, honestly. Oh, Gloom has fainted. Hudson is level 15. Yeah, boy. Uh, Ranger Max has been defeated. Let's remember for a change to use an antidote. I need to go buy some more antidotes at this rate. Goodness me. Goodness me. I talk like an old lady sometimes when I'm recording. I don't know why. I think it's because I'm trying not to say a bunch of swear words, which is 90% of my vocabulary most of the time, but apparently YouTube doesn't like it because they're soft. <laughs> they want me to be kid friendly, so that's what we got to do sometimes. And it's plants and berries. Um, yeah, anyway. Leper berries. Yeah, so I need <laughs> trying to think of what to say that's not just the F word constantly and um, ends up talking like a grandma. I'm probably never going to come back for these berries, so I don't know why I'm replanting them, but I just feel like it's appropriate. It would be rude of me to take and not to give back. Oh my god, I'm just running into everything. Okay. Who's second in the party? Let's go with that. See how that goes for double battle. Bum, 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 bum. Ma and Pop, Max and Joe. 
with an R2 and a Cliff Babel. Okay. Not too worried about that. Use a water gun on... It doesn't really matter. We'll use a water gun on Natu. I guess we'll use a Twister on both of them. That's handy that Twister hits both. That did not do a lot of damage. The Fable is thick. That's going to do 16 damage every time. That's not great. Not great at all. Neither was that crit. It didn't appreciate... Well, I'll take out the Natu, so we won't be worried about Nightshade anymore. So that's something. Doop, doop. Did not do much. Growing Groot level 16, though. That's good. Solid two in every stat. Very nice. Hmm. Clefable flinched. Awesome. Awesome. <sighs> um, I, I don't know. We'll use a wrap. I feel like it's going to take a f oh my god, I missed! But I feel like it's going to take a few turns to get through this meaty Clefable. Oh, that was scary. I thought that was going to do a lot of damage, just by the name Crush Claw. Yeah, surely that next turn you'll be out of here. Leave River alone! Why are you not attacking Ryan at all? All right, you're out of here, Clefable. You're done and dusted, mate. You did not stand a chance. No one leveled up from that fight. That's fair. All right. Oh, we got another battle. Pokemon is delightfully... My Pokemon is delightfully adorable. Don't be shy. I'll show you. I don't know why I'm bobbing so much. I need... To move! Um, Leader Marshall sent out a Silcoon. I ain't afraid of no Silcoon. I will very, very, very slowly whittle it down. Oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe I'll critical hit it and take it out in one shot. Ooh, almost 17. Ryan is putting in the work. Hell yeah. Love that. Who are you? If you cross the sea from here, you'll be, it'll be a shortcut to Old Ale Town. Foo, 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 foo. Foo, 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 foo. Love that. Uh, he's frustrated and mean. Let's battle. Ooh, three Pokemon. Boss Scarlet has an Eevee. Oh, this dude normally got Magikarps, doesn't he? Surely, because it's level five. Ryan grew level 17. Wonderful. Wonderful. He is really getting up there. Uh, a Gyarados? We'll stick it out. Level 10 Gyarados. See how much tackle does. Not too bad. Thrash is a bit scary though. Uh, he will confuse himself in a couple of turns. Does Thrash get stronger each turn? I mm, uh, don't think so, but that did crit. Now he's confused. You want to hit yourself, mate? Please? No. Nah. Why would you? Why would you? Fine. Get rid of you. You're out of here. Ooh, not bad. I didn't even see who's coming in. Doesn't matter. Ryan needs the experience. Salamence! Uh. Okay, okay. Don't have any dragon type moves. Oh, we do with River, but he needs a heal. But also, River's also dragon type, so that would be dangerous, to say the least. So, we'll go to Kess. Not too worried about Aaliyah. Not too worried. Why did the strongest one have to be the Salamence? Why couldn't the level 5 be a Salamence? And Rock's throw misses. Good start, good start. At least Rage is doing little to no damage. Oh, that's good. I'm happy with that. I am very happy with that. Done. You're out of here, mate. And that's a solid 349 experience each. Ryan getting to level 18. Ooh, Kess is halfway to level 18. Ryan's already, like, top of the pack. 
Except for River and Matt. That didn't take long. Uh, we're going to have to put Hudson at the front of the pack, I think. For some switch training, that is. Got to try and keep it even, you know? Uh, I'm going to the Pokemon Center, if you didn't know, because everyone is a bit weak. Dun, 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 dun. And we're going to leave it on a cliffhanger. Rival fight at the start of next episode. So you're not going to want to miss that because I might lose. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. If you enjoyed, leave a like, subscribe to my channel, ring a bell. I don't know. I've never rang anyone's bell. <laughs> um, yeah. Have a good day. See you next time.